we are on approach to Cozumel. Look at the Celebrity Infinity out there. I think there's going to be five ships in port today. Good Buenos morning. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. We are almost in Cozumel. Yeah, another like hour, I think. Oh yeah, that's mm -hmm. right. It's about eight o'clock. We've ordered room service breakfast to come for the gang. We're yeah. gonna gather over here, have a lovely breakfast. Mm -hmm. Leisure. <laughs> yep, and then we're gonna hop off. Yep. Um we're doing something we've done before. It's been a while actually. It has. It's fun with friends. Yeah, we decided we said, Ricky and Laura, y'all choose what you wanna do today. Anything in the world in Cosmo you could do. And they said San Chose. Yep. Going with Mr. Sanchez. Yeah. Coconut shrimp. Oh. Drinks in the pool and have Ooh. fun music with our friends. So it's gonna be a good day. Yeah. That's true. So. <laughs> There's this you noise. Know, this noise. All night long. You probably didn't hear it. There was a lot of bang oh. bang. Yeah. Outside our room. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo. Uh, anyway, breakfast. Yep. And we'll catch up with y'all when we're on the way to Cosmo. Yeah. Bye. Adios. Oh, we got all kinds of breads and toasts and croissants, jellies, coffees. All right. Down to deck three. 4.30 back on board. Now the room is very cold and it is very warm out here. So, uh, yeah, there's Celebrity Infinity. <laughs> yeah, we're still fogged up, but yeah, we got Grandeur of the Seas and Celebrity Infinity over there through the haze. All right, the lens is starting to clear up. We're gonna head up here to the taxi stand. All right, we have made it. Yeah, it's pretty quiet here. I think we beat the crowds. We need a nice big van. Oh yes, now we're riding in style. No little cramped car for us today. <laughs> Bienvenidos a Mr. Sancho's. Oh yeah, we got the cute little market. We should need hats and bags and all that stuff. Let's come into the check-in office. Ooh, they have fancified up their ATM since I last saw it. Current rate sheet on the wall. Okay, 60 per adult, 40 per teen, 35 per child. Oh, and 12 bucks to add on the aqua park. Here we are all checked in. Let's see if we can wander and figure out where we will be hanging out for the day. Well, they do have the buffet going still. Yes, we got wings, potatoes, fajitas, rice. All right. Little pizzas, don't slam the door. That's kind of the shallow kiddie pool area. All right, we're gonna be on this side. So we got Norberto and Fernando. Oh, Here's our eat. food menu. Oh, oh gosh, let's throw in some orders. Be drunk today. Nobody know you here. <laughs> there is the drink side of things. Oof, it is warm and humid right now. Wow. Our first orders have arrived. He has gone Cozumel Breeze for her first attack. That is vodka, coconut rum, lemon juice, and Sprite. And it's so refreshing and light. And he said it was his favorite. Yeah. I decided to get tamarind daiquiri. Nice and sour, tart. And we've started off with chips, salsa, guacamole. Breakfast of champions. Oh, Dee's starting off with shrimp ceviche. How did we know? So good. It's your favorite. <laughs> Oh, we got coconut shrimp coming in strong. Oh, the drinks are coming. Oh, we got nachos and Caribbean fries coming in down there. Thank you. Ooh, shrimp cocktail. I don't think I've ever had that here. Nice. All right, I guess next up we are going to check out this ocean boat. It is time to hit this water. It is a little refreshing on the feet, which is nice. Trying to figure out a good entry zone because all I see is these like dark swaths of rocks out here. Yeah, I don't think you would really need water shoes because the rocks are pretty flat. And I guess once you get past them, it sands out just a little. You look refreshed out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> My shoulders are refreshed. Oh, I've made it to the deepish zone. I can float around. Well, have my the tamarind margaritas i'm finding are actually pretty nice i always got tamarind daiquiris never realized they did tamarind margaritas so i don't know where my sunglasses now the sun is out it's not smart is it oh i hear some folks up there playing despacito for one of the tables over there they'll come around and play for tips and stuff like that we saw somebody had a couple of like blue ish parrots that you could take pictures with for tips Oh yeah, Ricky has gone up to place a drink order for everybody. He graciously volunteered. Yeah. 
Well, Laura and I have oh, gone to fun. New York. We decided to take a trip to New York. What'd you get, Margarita? I'm in Mexico, so ah. yeah, I'm in the right area, yeah. <laughs> All right, let us hop out of here. We've been in the ocean for a while. Probably grab some snacks. Maybe go to the pool. Now, we put in a food order, but Ricky decided to go to the buffet. Oh, you got rice and pizza. And a chicken wing. And a chicken wing. I have never had Sancho's pizza. Right, now, the cheese is remarkably a vibrant yellow. I don't know what kind of cheese it is. It smells like pizza. It's not like Mexican pizza from Taco Bell, which I've never had a Mexican pizza at Taco Bell. Have y'all had Mexican pizza? Oh, it's so good. Okay, yeah. I've never had it. Oh, that's so good. Okay, it's a little weird. It's very, it's very cafeteria. Mm. It'll do the job though, yeah? Think like elementary school, go to the cafe, like there's usually, a, you get the rectangle pizza in elementary school. It's like that, maybe one step down. It's good, it's good, it'll get the job done. Well, it's got that nice little spongy crust on it. You know what I mean, you know what I mean. Oh, I think so. Oh, we got Long Beaches happening, so they made the Long Beaches good. Alberto made the first so you, the wing, chicken wing is pretty good. Okay. Yes. So wings approved, pizza questionable, Long Beaches, yes. Yeah. Oh, no, they're strong, yeah. Thank That's you. a lot of carbs. Oh gosh, we got coconut shrimp, we got fries, nachos, chili beans, chicken tacos, coconut shrimp. We're in business now. And we got Whitney on the radio. Yep. There's a bee. Not the bee though. Yeah, we've come back over to the main pool area. Let's see if we can have some fun over here. First up, washy washy. Oh yeah. We got Julio over here in our bar. He is normally on the other side. That is amazing. Give him a tip now. <laughs> All right, did you, you got a little heart on your cup from Julio? Oh, wow. This is probably the busiest I've ever seen the pool, but it's because it the other pool is for like all inclusive guests now at the hotel. Yeah. I got purple rain. It says, Welcome home. Oh, I got it on my cup too. Welcome home. You got a little heart. Aww. I just <laughs> All right, we got Macarena action. Can't really hear the music from in here, but that's all right. We made friends already. Look at the whole live dance going, the group dance. We went up to the bar to try to get another drink. Julio had already poured four Purple Rains. He knows what's up. Oh, they busted out the wobble. Okay, you know this has to happen. Here we go. Coordinated pool group wobble. She's like the teacher over there. That's awesome. Oh, she is a teacher. That's hilarious. Yo, you never know what's going to happen at Sancho's. <laughs> oh, now you're going to be teaching. Oh, they broke out the Cupid now. It is a part. Hey. Oh, everybody's got to get going the same direction. Laura went up and got a couple of bee breezes. Oh gosh, all right, that was hers. This was mine, baby. <laughs> the cha-cha slide has come out. Now they're doing the how low can you go, which in the pool is a little dangerous. Underwater. I'm not sure how that works. And we have the mariachis behind us too, so like lots of music. But it's yeah. fun, this is the best pool party ever. Oh gosh, it's a spelling test. I don't know if we can pass that right now. I can't spell. I can't spell. <laughs> yeah. So, I'm over sugary drinks. So, Ricky and Laura, no, Ricky and Robin suggest that beer is probably a better option. I hate beer. We're not beer people. It's a... Tecate Light. -like. Tecate? Okay. Uh, this may or may not go well. It's gonna taste like beer. It smells Just, like beer. Uh-huh. Just no. Yeah. So it's good. But I like like Aperol and bitter drinks. Okay, go for it. 
I can handle. <laughs> the face says that, right? Face I, can, I actually can otherwise. handle that. That's not bad. All right, I asked Laura to go up and ask Julio for una sorpresa. What did he did he say what it was? It's just a surprise. Okay. Mystery drink. We don't know. Aww. A little sweet, but that's good. It's actually no good. idea what it is. Yeah. All right, the time has come for us to vacate the pool. We hate to see it. Yeah, we're getting a few last minute snacks before we go. The band is helping down here playing some songs. That's more juicy. Right, we are heading out of our day at Sancho's reluctantly. Goodbye, fun pool. <laughs> oh, looks like we got a nice ride back. Well, welcome back to Puerto Vallarta. I think we're gonna do a little bit of shopping and then hop back on board. We are gonna come into Viva Mexico or Viva Mexico because Laura wants to get some vanilla. She needs a mug. All kinds of stuff. Ricky's gonna help vanilla. Shopping success. It is time to head back to the ship. Oh, we have two carnival ships in port now. Aha, it's conquest as well as, of course, ecstasy. Now we just have to make it through the duty-free shop. Look at this old girl. We're just admiring her beauty as we walk down the pier. She looking good. They are trying to make us sad right now. Uh, we are headed out of Cozumel. The humidity might get us a little bit. Try to see if I can wipe the lens so we can get any parting views. We still have one more port of call tomorrow before heading back to Alabama. You know, this is remarkably bittersweet. I'm not going to lie. As we pull away, we see some ships in the distance. Hear the balcony door snapping shut behind me. Leaving Cozumel on this ship for the very last time. I know, we're going to keep saying last time so much, but it's weird. I got to tell you. Yeah, I think that's a little grandeur of the seas making her way way out there to the left. MSC Seashore still, mm, I don't know if they're docked or moving over there to the right. There's old Celebrity Infinity back there behind us. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. <laughs> we are ready. We don't know what we're ready for. No, not yet. Um, we were thinking about dinner, but we're mm -hmm. going to wait till the gang gets here in a little bit. Uh, we're all fresh and clean to be prepared for yeah. anything. but We'll let them decide what they want to do. With all that snacking at Sancho's, we don't know if we're going to go do full-fledged dinner. Mm -hmm. Not we sure might. Yet. It was a great day though. Yeah, how was Sanchez your day? Sanchez is always fun, especially when you're with friends. Yeah. Um, the ocean was really nice and refreshing. No snorkeling today, I was a little stirred up, but um, the pool, the most crowded I've ever yeah, seen it. Because they closed the one side mm. uh, for like, I guess all inclusive weeks. kind of mm. like staying there at like a hotel or resort. So it's just the one pool. But it was yeah. so fun. It was the best pool party ever. We danced. I, I was <laughs> glad to see Julio over there. Yeah, we haven't seen Julio good. forever. He's our favorite bartender there for sure. He's usually over in like the secret mm -hmm. area now, but anyway. Yeah. That's all I know. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we just had our last sail away from Cozumel on Ecstasy. Yeah. It's, it's going to be, I'm telling you, this is a weird cruise. Yeah. I'm glad we're here to like experience some of this stuff. Tomorrow will be a little weird because it's the last ever like port of call sail away. It was super sweet. I went out on the balcony and they were blowing the horn for us to leave and Conquest mm. was all cheering because they know. So that was like super sweet. That's like, true. Oh. It's a big goodbye to little sister. <laughs> yeah. But we're going to see what the heck happens. We'll probably get some food eventually. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Love and marriage tonight. Ooh. Some other stuff, yeah. All right. Well, we'll see you all when we see you. <laughs> all right. Bye. <laughs> Adios. I hear steel drum tunes. Oh, we do have a live steel drum player. Hey.
Gosh, there's all kinds of ship models on here. Oh, they got chef's table going in the library. Interesting. And now it is time to head into Blue Sapphire for an evening of stuff and things. So first up in here we have the Showdown game show, followed by Bingo, and then Love and Marriage. So I am going to divide this room into two parts. So who wants to be the team captain from the this side? I am going to tell you a quote and you have to stand according in that order. 4,213. 4,213. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> it is the Star Wars side! Let's say I said you are fighting. So you will start, you know, acting like fighting. And then I say freeze. You have to freeze. So you are in a yoga class and somebody farted. Somebody farted in a yoga class. And in five, four, three, two, one, and freeze. This is a race. So you have to sit down on the towel. Your feet, your hand, your body, nothing can touch the ground. All right, let's get it started in three, two, one, and let's go. Uh-oh. And you have and to the pull this shampoo around your legs. Oh and go three times. Don't look back. <laughs> one, two, and one more. Just like this. Three. And hold this between your legs. And then you cannot touch your head. <laughs> and in the end, you're gonna go. <laughs> you just have to put this medallion in the bucket. And you have to just put it in your butt cheeks right over here. And you do the walk, 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 right over Go grab yourself a big machine and I will see you around. Thank you everyone and bye. Well, we have got some bingo excitement going on. One of us is going to hit something. I can feel it. Yeah, maybe. Thanks for coming out to play bingo with me tonight. That's 074. 074. Oh, 074. Oh, 074 for this one. Oh. We got five of them. One, one G way one on this card. You have to see a B or an eyeball. He looks friendly. Oh, they got a bingo. That was not what we needed. Whoa, possible claim to bingo on round two? Uh, not us. <laughs> Who do we nope. have back there, nope. King? But for each bean bag you sink in that hole, we're gonna have a hundred dollars to your prize. And if you sink all five, you're going home with two thousand dollars. Who wants to take on the bean bag challenge tonight? Oh, there's a claim to bingo in again. Does it's not a us. Good picture frame. That is a good picture frame playing the bingo. Congratulations, Kathy. Yes, Kathy, and your earliest can be. Oh, that was close. That was really close. All right, Kathy, come on, come on. Boom, boom. It's gonna knock. That one went in. That one went in. I saw that. The wings took it over. The wings. That's 350. All right, Kathy. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That one went in too. That's 450. Wow, the wind in it. Yeah, okay. That's 550. That's 550. It is almost time for love and marriage. Oh, there we go. There's the song. Now, tonight we are celebrating this little thing called love. And this is the very last. Love and Marriage Game Show happening on board this vessel. What we're going to do is bring three couples up on stage and find out just how well y'all know each other. First couple I'm looking for is our most newlywed couple in the room. When did y'all get married? Sunday. All right, it's Wednesday, so that officially makes you our most newlywed couple on board. It's been three days. Next up, we're looking for our longest married couple in the room, or our only ones, if you will. How long have the two of you been married? 52 years. A couple months ago, 
I had a couple that had been married for 63 years. I asked the husband, hey sir, what's the secret to 63 years of happy marriage? This man looks me dead in my eyes and he says, brother, at this point you just won't die. <laughs> and you, our studio audience, are going to vote on our third and final couple. However, they are going to have to have a little bit of an audition process. The way that we're gonna choose our final couple is with a good old fashioned make out competition. <laughs> chosen to take part in tonight's show, no worries, you're more than welcome to take part in it in your own special way. Y'all can just sit out there in the audience and play with yourselves. <laughs> you know what I mean. Let's play the Love and Marriage Game Show, everyone. Bum, bum, bum. But look, I've only saved a few of these, alright? We don't have many left. In fact, we're almost completely out, but I wanted to make sure we had some for the very last Love and Marriage Game Show. For each one of you, a 24 karat gold ship on a stick. Now look, look, if somebody with a diamond or platinum card approaches you about that, the starting price is $50. Folks, one more time, give it up for our couple here on stage. Ooh, shopping, shopping, shopping. We have come back to the cabin to find this. It's cute. I think it's like a, a muscle Platypus. duck. Platypus. I don't know. <laughs> there you go. Good night. <laughs> it is sleepy time. Yes. I think it's only like 10.30, 10.45. Mm, it's late. It's late, y'all. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so we are in, I keep wanting to say Costa Maya. It's not. It's Progresso. Yeah. You get to have. What, second time there ever? Mm. Yeah. You don't get there very often. How was your day? Great. No, today was an awesome day. Just chilling with friends and having fun and going Not back to Not making a ton of content, but oh, well, you know. Well, to be fair though, the pool was packed. And we don't like filming a whole lot no. of other people if we can avoid it. So if there wasn't a whole lot of content, we apologize, but that's why. We, we had fun We had a though. dance party that was good. Um, and then the evening activities were really fun. And now we're back in what is the most cold room we've ever had Truth. in the history of cruising. <laughs> this is the coldest room ever. You are not wrong. It's good they have good air conditioning on the ship. <laughs> Y'all will appreciate it when you say oh, ecstasy stop. in the future. I, maybe the other fantasy class do. I could take this air conditioner and put it on another they ship. They should. <laughs> I keep saying they should take the funnel off of this and put it on Freedom. Is that a stupid idea? Fit. Oh, it's a good idea, though, Carnival. Yeah, you know, we're going to bed. We are. So see you tomorrow from more Mexico. Yeah. Bye. Good night.